Hey! The Chimera gets up and looks over as if he wants to join the party. Absolutely. Hello everyone, this is BCS Buster and welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Quest V. Now you might notice that I've made it back here to just outside of Mar Mount Magmageddon uh, because I wanted to pick up a Chimera. And this is the best place to do it. It took me about 15 or eh, close to 15, maybe closer to 20 minutes with turbo mode to get the Chimera, but it is definitely worth it. So, yeah, all right, let's check him out real quick. Check this out. He just joins the party. Look at those stats for being at level three. Like, he is better than some of my current party members. Look at this. That's awesome. He's in really good shape, so we definitely want to get him hooked up. So, what we want to do is we want to take that Staff of Anti-Magic. Actually, we want to transfer that over. And I don't like his name. We'll have, to, we'll have to do something about that. Yep. Okay, so his attack power was 68. Watch this. <laughs> his attack power went up by 40 to 108. He, he is one of the... It's one of the best ones we got. So, okay. Now what we want to do... Let's go ahead and return to... Lodestone Harbor, because I want to pick up... I want to pick up something. Uh, wait. Was it here? No, I'm sorry. It was back to Montferro. That's where I want to go. Sorry. There we go. Whee! And you know what? I lied. I lied again. Because what I actually want to do... <laughs> I have help with Fortunately, I have a lot of MP, so I can do this. I actually want to head back to uh, Fortuna. And I want to make some adjustments to my monsters now that I've picked up a Chimera. By the way, Chimera starts at level 3. and er, Yeah, it starts with mid-heal. So that's good. So another character that can that can heal, and that's a good thing. But okay, so what I want to do here is go down here. I want to drop off a couple things here. Uh, first off, let's go ahead and drop off. Uh, let's go ahead and drop off Preston. I won't be needing him anymore. Uh, and actually, what I'd like to do is I want to change Kim's name. I don't really like that name. Um, so I want to re I want to rename him. And unfortunately, all I can do you can only rename them when they're when they're being looked at, which is kind of strange, but what I want to do is I want to rename it the name from the first series of games. And I'm going to name him Wyvern. That way I can remember who it is. Yeah, this is the sprite for Wyvern from the first four Dragon Quest games, so let's do that. Yay! Terrific. No more renaming. Well, let's go ahead and pick up. Let's go ahead and pick him up. Alright. Excellent. Terrific. Okay, so that's all I want to do there. Okay, great. Now what I want to do is I actually want to head now. Let's go ahead and zoom over to Most of Parado. We have the ship there, which you may recall. And now what I want to do is rest up at the end. Because unfortunately, I can only buy armor during the day, so. Okay, let's go heal up. Yes, that'd be great. Very nice. Okay. Now that we got that all taken care of, what I want to do is I want to head down to the armor shop. Okay. Now from here, I want to go ahead and pick up a Cloak of Evasion. Yeah. So not only is it a great increase in defense for the Wyvern, but he can sometimes escape an attack altogether. Let's go ahead and give that to the Wyvern. Uh-huh. Excellent. I also want to pick up, I believe this is the best helmet it can, it can equip in the game, which is a top hat. Let's go ahead and give that to the Wyvern as well. Yep. All right. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay, I believe I'm in mean, tortoise shell. Eh, I don't care about that. Man, it might not be bad for healing, but I, feel, I want to say I can get something else. Uh, you know what? Healy's going to be fine. I'm going to save it for a little bit later. Okay, excellent. Now, let's get our lineup together. Oh, you know, I have to do this once, once we're outside. But, all right, let's go ahead and get out of here. I'm actually going to get Wyvern to my party right away, because he's pretty darn good. And I want to start building him up. So, like if you look, he's almost just as good at attack power as Saber, and has, you know, only at level 3. So that's a huge, huge, huge boost. So, well, but you know what? This is a little bit better. So actually what I'm going to do is let's go... 
go in this order. I'm gonna go Healy first. I be believe it, BZS Buster's actually near the bottom, oddly enough. Then Wyvern. Then yeah, and then duh. Actually, who's his attack? His attack power is better. Let me get heal. Um Let's do this for now. Okay. Now we're in good shape. Excellent. Okay. Very good. Now we are in good shape. I basically want to build up all of these monsters for sure. So, okay. Let's go ahead and get our ship. Alrighty. Yay. Now what we want to do is head north. Oops. Back on the ship. Thank you. And now we can sail the seas. Oh, what have we here? Here, please. Oh. Yeah, we need to notify someone in the Stock and Barrel Village, eh? Well, fortunately, that village is right here. Okay, let's see what this wyvern can do. Ow. Ooh, -hoo, nice. Good job. Very good. Alright, and actually, believe it or not, there's some monsters I actually want to... I believe I can fight some monsters here on the sea. I want to do that now, so I can add them to my bestiary. So, let's see if I can find these monsters here. Well, let's see. There we go. Ah, I got some new enemies here. Morphean Mollusks. So again, why don't you use physical attacks to get them down? If you have some lightning magic, it'll probably work very well here. Don't fall asleep. Ugh. Damn it. I can actually get some sweet... Yeah, there are some enemies that can learn sweet breath. I think Wyvern might be one of them. But, okay. Excellent. And there's a few different... None of them can be recruited, but there is a specific one that can... I believe if you want to complete your beast area, you have to get it now. So I'm going to see if I can do that. I wish I had a way to... to draw more... Or I could... To increase the encounter rate. Because right now the encounter rate is pretty low on the scene. We got some new enemies here. Sea dogs. Okay. Yar, the sea dog. Ow. Put it. Go. Again, just standard operating procedure. Yeah, just use physical attacks. Take him down. Excellent. Very nice. Okay. Um, let's see. Let's see what else we can find here. Ooh, there's a shrine there. I have to go check that out. Okay, let's see. We got another new enemy here. Polywiggle. Here's the one I'm looking for. Now, I believe this is the only place in the game where you can find this enemy. So you gotta take it out now, otherwise you can do it later in the game. Fortunately, they're pretty weak. So if you wanna, again, if you wanna complete your bestiary, you gotta take them out now. Nice! Good shot, Wyvern. His agility's low right now, but oh, believe me, he will get a lot better. And Wyvern gains a level. Not bad, it will get better, I promise. And Gudian gains a level. Terrific. Okay, that's really the only one I wanted to get. Uh, there are two more, but... I want to get him now. And let's go ahead and finish off. Why not? Just for the sake of finish, get him now. There's only five enemies, so it shouldn't take me too long to get him. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Get a turbo here. There's another one, a merman. Merman! Merman! Shout out to my boy Zoolander there. Oh! No problems there. Okay, and there's one more. So let's see if I can find it. Oh. Okay, I'm looking turbo mode to see if it shows up. Man, the encounter rate's really low. And there it is. The Sucking Ocker. That's a bizarre name. But, nonetheless, we got it. All right, very good. Now we can actually do what I actually want to do, which is head over to the village. So let's head up here. 
and enter the village of Stock and Barrel. Ah, well that's lovely. Okay, we have a kitty. Oh, I love kitties. Okay, let's see. Okay, okay. Let's go see what we got here. Anything down here? Oh, there's a man. Oh, really? Oh. <laughs> a desert rose, eh? Huh. Okay, well, well, we'll have to, uh... Yeah, I got it, man. Don't worry about it. We're all good. Okay. Sounds good. So we need to go find him a desert rose, which we'll, we'll do a little bit later. Okay, can't move us anything there. There's the item shop. We need it. Hang over here. Okay, let's take a look. Let's see what else we got here. Oh, a priest! That's okay. What's wrong with being a priest? There's nothing at all. Oh, by the way, there's a couple items I forgot to get. My fault. So the item shop. Alright, now if we go here. Aha! There we go. A seed of strength. Very good. An urn spected! Uh-oh! Okay, now we've got a rare monster here, an urn spectin. Phew! Now, I believe he can be paralyzed if you have burning breath magic. So just use that if you've got it. Otherwise, just use physical attacks, go all out, take him down. Uh-oh. I think that I think the wax spell is instant death, so that could have been bad, but we got him. No problems there. So there you are. Okay, let's take a look and see if we got anything here. Nope. And I don't really need to go to the item shop. I just want to do those two things. Okay, let's go and see what else we got here. This guy, was this the guy that said he wanted to be a priest? Oh. All right. So this is how we can save. So even while still wanting to be priests, they still are priests. So that's a good thing. Oh. And if you open the grave, somehow you get a mini medal. Uh, don't really know how that works, but okay. Huh. Huh. Well, great. Well, if we could just find out that person that could open it just for us, that would be terrific. Okay, uh, let's see. Go here. And if you need to pick up some weapons, you can. How are we doing weapon-wise, anyway? Uh, I think paralyzed is hard, but that's good. Steel bronze sword. Yeah, so this is actually not a. If you you might want to consider picking up a a cautery sword because if you use that as an item in battle, it can actually get a fire attack. So not a bad idea. I'm just, I'm gonna wait for now, and uh, I may get something a little bit better a little bit later. But there's the inn if you need it. White King's Paradise. I heard something about that. Oh, interesting. What if you go in here? Uh, okay. Absolutely. I would. Yeah, I have a. <laughs> I've never. Uh, nope. Oh, maybe six time, eh? Oh, I see there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He must be from Canada. All right then. Very good. So ba uh, this is kind of like a resort town. Oh, that's cool. Okay, by the way, don't worry about staying at the inn because we're actually going to get a free inn stay here in just a little bit. But oh. we we'll have to come back here during the night. But if you go in here, you get a mini metal. Excellent. I'll look at that now. Okay, let's go this way. I believe, where is it? There it is. There's a medicinal herb. Not that I really need it, but it could be useful. Okay, I can get over to that side. Can't get over there right now. Okay. Well, we'll we we'll have to come. Looks like we'll have to come back here tonight. Now, I guess uh, I can talk to people up here. Ah, right, there we are. Wait, Bianca. Wait a minute. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I had, I had a friend named Bianca at the beginning of the game. It couldn't possibly be her. Could it? Either way. Let's keep, uh, let's keep taking a look around, see what we can find here. What do we have here? 
Huh? Whitey? Hey, how's it going? Hello, how are you? Uh, I don't remember. When was the last time we met? Oh yeah! Yes, hi, how are you? Oh my gosh! Oh yeah! How, uh, well... Yeah... Unfortunately. Well... Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Uh, no, I didn't. Wait a minute. No way. No way. Wow! We're reunited! Woohoo! Oh, that's great. Wow, my old friend Bianca! That's awesome. Wow. Uh, well. Of course not. Hey, what? Oh, yeah. Oh, well, this is wonderful. Wow, they talked all night. Oh, okay. And this is why you didn't want to stay at the end, because you get that free end stay. But all right. Let's pop out of bed. For some reason, we uh, get to sleep in the same bed as three monsters, but that's fine. All right, excellent. Uh, okay. Okay. Now, before heading out, uh, oh, apparently they're not gonna let me leave yet. Oh, I see. Oh, wow. Wow, so he wants her and I to get together. Wow. Okay. Yes, okay. I'm definitely hungry. What'd you say? Oh, I see. Um, now nah, it's okay. Now nah, it's okay. Ugh. Okay, yes, it is a butt down must moment. All right. Will do. All righty. Sounds good. Unfortunately, no, I say unfortunately. Now, we do need her, unfortunately. To we need her to advance the game, so that's why you need to come here. Now, there's one other thing that I want to do. Uh, let's see, I believe, is it here? Yeah! See, there's this little hidden area down here. Uh, well, this is a RPG, that's kind of what you do. Now, if we go down here, where's the chest which contains... Oh, just a TNT tick. Yeah, nothing special, but it's there. All right. So, uh, I believe we are ready to go, but um, you know what? I think I'm gonna return to the pub at night. So let me let me just check that and check my time real quick, uh, and then I'll be right back. Okay, I've returned here at night, and there's a couple other things we can do now that it is nighttime. First thing I'm gonna do is head up here. I believe I forgot to do this earlier, but if you go up here, I want to say there's some stuff here. Ah, hurrah for herbs! I see. <laughs> yeah, so, I forgot about that there. Okay, let's head to the pub and see what everyone says about Bianca. I believe they say some things here at the pub. Wow. <laughs> wow. I see. For Bianca's sake. Does he like her or something? Oh, yeah, I heard about that. Hmm. I agree. Oh, yeah. Wow, there's that whole marriage thing again. Hmm. Okay. Well, then. Okay, so let's see now, if, if even though if it's night, if Bianca will, in fact, join us. Because we actually do need her to advance the plot. So hopefully she's still awake. Yep. Yep, let's do it. All right. Just like that, Bianca has once again joined the team. All right. Let's see how she's doing. 
Ooh, level 18. That's not bad. It's not good, but it's not bad. But she's got a lot of spells. So she's kind of our magic user right now. And she has safe passage. That could have been useful in the last area, but... Okay. Let's see if there's anything we can give her. Can she equip the chain whip? Because that would be help. That would be great. Of course she can't. Why would she be able to do that? Ugh. Okay, let's see. Well, now that we have some female stuff, I wonder if she can equip some of this stuff. And not as good. Okay, so I'll probably need to sell that. I wanted to hang on to this stuff just in case. Okay, silver tiara. She should be able to equip that. That's better. Let's go ahead and give that to her. That. What else? I may have to stop. Oh, I can sell those. Uh, let's see. Time Moment Cave, I bet that's not as good. No, Hairband, I bet that's not as good. Nope. Okay, so I can go ahead and sell those things for sure. Anything else? Just so I can sell that. Yeah, I can sell the silk robe. Okay, sounds good. I may have to stop. I may have to pick up some equipment for next time. But, uh, okay. Let us... Is the item shop open? Let's see if it's still open at, even at night. Nope. Oh, okay. Well, that's fine. Okay, so what I need to do now is I would I need to go sell some of my excess equipment and then uh, rearrange my party and then get ready to go. But now that Bianca's back on the team, what awaits us past the gate? And can we find the circle of water? You have to wait the next time to find out. Till then, this is BCS Buster signing off. Don't forget to like me on Facebook. Follow me on Twitter, BCS Buster LP. Check out my donations page. And as always, take care, y'all.